What are you going to do on the weekend, Tim? I may go to a movie on Saturday night. On Sunday I'm going to ride my bike in the park. Some of my friends may be there too. Are you going to work in the library on Saturday afternoon? I'm going to be there from 2 to 4. In the morning I can go there. But in the afternoon I may go shopping with John. He wants to buy a present for his brother. Next Friday he's going to graduate from high school. We may not have time to shop next week. Oh, then maybe we can get together later. Is that your guitar? Yes, it is. Are you good at playing guitar? My friends say that I'm pretty good. Can you play a song for me? I'd love to but I'm starving right now. Come on, just a little. All right. Let's go and have lunch. All right. Let's go. Do you have any relatives in London, Mrs. Carter? No, I don't, but I have a brother in Manchester. He and his family are going to visit me next Saturday. Oh, that's nice. What is your brother's name? His name is James Carter. Do you have any relatives in this country, Mrs. Carter? Yes, I do. I have two cousins in New York, and my husband has a brother in Los Angeles. Do you have any relatives here? No, I don't, but my husband has a cousin in New York. Is Mr. Scott's wife living? No, she isn't. She died several years ago. Does Mr. Scott have any relatives? Yes, he does. He has two nieces in New York and a nephew in Miami. Would you like to drink coffee? I can make you some coffee. That would be great. Thank you. Do you want anything else? Do you want biscuits too? I would love that. Thank you. I want to buy some postcards and some stamps. Well, the newsstand is across the street. And the post office is at the end of the street. What a nice city. In my city our stores are bigger than yours, but our streets are dirtier. My city has the tallest buildings in the country. I think our parks may be prettier than yours too. Well, do you want to come to the newsstand with me? No, thanks. I don't need any postcards. I'm tired. I want to go to the apartment. Okay, but are you sure you can find your way? I don't know. Well, turn right in front of the post office, and walk past the police station. Our street is the second on the left. You can't miss it. Thanks. I think I can find my way. Oh, before I forget. What are we going to have for dinner this evening? I'm going to order pizza when I get to the apartment. Great. I love pizza. I will be at the apartment at 8. All right. Do you like sushi? I want to order some sushi too. I haven't eaten sushi in a while. But I like it. Great. I'll see you in the evening. Hi Julia. Have you had your holiday for this year yet? Not yet. I'm taking it at the end of October. Where are you going? Have you made up your mind? Not really. I thought of going to France again. But I've already been there twice. I'd like to try somewhere new. My brother's just gone to Brazil for two weeks. I had a call from him yesterday. 
He seems to be having a good time. Why don't you go there? I want to go to Brazil. But I don't think I can afford it. Flight tickets are quite expensive. You are right. But you don't need to spend a lot when you get there. I've already spent a lot of money this year. I haven't got much to spare for expensive holidays abroad. I understand you. Maybe I'll just go to Wales or Ireland in the end. I've heard they're both very beautiful. I haven't been to either of them. I went to Wales two years ago, to pay Josh and his wife a visit. If you decide on Wales, you can call in on them. Josh would willingly put you up for a few days, I'm sure. That's a good idea. I haven't seen Josh for more than two years now. I'd like to know how he is getting on. All right. Have a nice day. You too, Nick. Hi, Nick. Hi, Julia. Where did you head your holiday? I went to Germany. I was in Berlin. Did you enjoy your time in Berlin? Yes, I did. It was great. I've brought you back some presents. Thank you. That's lovely. But you didn't need to. Well, I don't often buy you a present. But I don't often go to Berlin either. Tell me about it. What did you do there? We had quite a good flight. We got to the hotel at about 8 o'clock. We had an amazing dinner. After the dinner, Lisa and I went to a theater. Didn't anyone else go with you? No, no one else wanted to come. All the others were too tired. Then on Friday morning we did some shopping. In the afternoon, we went to a stadium. It was the first time I've watched a football match. Where else did you go? Didn't you look round the museum island? Yes, we did. But it was a quick visit. And we went to see the Berlin Wall too, of course. But we didn't have time for much else. We were almost late for check-in at the airport. I see you had a fun time. Yes, I did. Berlin is a nice city. I wish I lived there. That's great to hear. My sister lives there. I go there once every year. I'm planning to go to Germany next year again. That's great. What else did you buy then? A few souvenirs and a bottle of perfume for my mom. Nothing else because I ran out of money. Okay. Let me buy you lunch. And we are going to keep talking about your trip. Sounds good. Hello everyone. Don't forget to repeat after us. Let's get started. Bless you. Do you have a cold? I think so. I feel tired. Where do you think you picked that up? My sister has it. Have you taken anything for it? I took some cold medicine this morning. Why don't you have a seat while I make you some vegetable soup? Okay. Thank you. Don't forget to wash your hands. I don't want you to catch my cold. Okay. I will wash my hands. You don't need to worry. I will be careful. You need to rest. You should drink plenty of water. You are right. Staying rested and hydrated is important. I have a glass of water right here. No, don't. Don't drink it. That's my glass. 
Oh, okay. Thanks for warning me. Believe me, you don't want to get my germs. Everyone seems to be getting sick these days. In order to stay healthy, we should exercise. Smoking is bad for our health.